Following the holidays, the shelves at the Oxford Orient Fish Food Pantry tend to get a little light, at least, until the post office food drive arrives in May. That's why ONTV has chosen February to host its annual food drive here at the studio. What started out as a one-day event has evolved into a week-long effort that focuses on monetary donations. Uh, welcome to the 14th annual ONTV Food Drive live in the ONTV studio here at the Orient Center. ONTV's 14th annual food drive got underway on Monday, February 5th, as Ian Locke and Matt Pfeiffer went live on the air at noon. Viewers were encouraged to visit the ONTV website to make a cash donation or to come to the Orient Center to help fill the production truck with food donations. The 14th annual, already 14 years of the ONTV food drive for fish, uh, it came about, of, of course, 14 years ago when the staff sat around and said, hey, what can we do in the winter months to get our uh, volunteers here at ONTV involved and showcase, in a way, the technology we have at the studio. And we partnered up with Oxford Orient Fish right away. And they said, oh, by the way, we have a huge need this time of year. And um, we decided, hey, let's do something telethon style, uh, live TV. And we did it for one day. And it worked out really well. And it has ballooned into a community event that uh, people are, you know, residents and uh, elected officials around the area come to expect this time of year. So it's now a true community event. ONTV went live for five days in a row this from noon great. until 2 p.m. with interviews and entertainment and special I'm guests sure who dropped in to make a donation. We have Bill and Pam. Bill and Pam uh, with uh, Madison Heights Plumbing and heating supply and uh, I'm gonna open this check uh, if you don't mind right oh. now so this is, um, this is from Madison Heights plumbing and uh, and heating supply and um, uh, you guys have been incredibly generous in everything that pops up in the community and um, so uh, I appreciate it and it's uh, well this would be a biggest donation uh, this year uh, and I, I think it was the biggest donation last year because you guys did this for us last year. Well, I don't know if we need to show it there. $5,000. $5,000. Um, thank you so much for your generosity. Please, I, I haven't met your sister. Please pass along to her the thank you, your kids, your family. You guys are great. Lake Orion residents, uh, we... Uh, um, you know, I uh, get to see each other around town a bit, and uh, and you're involved in some other service in the community with the Eagles. Um, and you guys are the epitome of what it means to be um, to be a good citizen and uh, and good people. And I am so thankful for you. Well, we like to support our community, that's for sure. And uh, normally we sponsor one shelf. This year we decided to continue with two shelves. So the donation is needed. Our community, you know, we love supporting them and uh, it's just what we do. So this covers uh, two shelves for 12 months for a total of $2,400 that goes to the total. Uh, overwhelming um, gift. Amazing. It's an absolutely overwhelming gift, yeah. I, I'm, it literally renders me speechless, which my husband can attest does not happen very often. As the food drive wound down on Friday, last minute cash and food donations made their way to the ONTV studio. When Ian Locke wrapped up the final live broadcast of the week, it was revealed that the 14th annual ONTV Food Drive raked in over $16,000 to feed hungry families in the Oxford Orion area. Immediately after the food drive signed off, a representative from Broadway Dance arrived to help fill the ONTV production truck with a massive donation of food. The ONTV staff drove the van to the food pantry in Oxford to deliver its payload and help keep those shelves stocked for the next few months. As always here in Oxford and Orion, we know when um, organizations like ours or other nonprofits say, hey, we need to uh, have a call to action to help those in need, the community always shows up. It always shows up. It has for 14 years for us here at the uh, ONTV Food Drive, and um, we know they will show up again. We'll be back for the 15th year uh, next year, and, and we know the community comes out. It's just overwhelming how uh, the response has spread now uh, up to Oxford. So now we're trying to incorporate Oxford uh, uh, help with donations uh, in the future. Just because the ONTV food drive has come to an end, that doesn't mean our work is done. ONTV is a food drop-off point all year long, and the food pantry continues to need your help. 
To make a donation or to volunteer your time, visit OxfordOrianFish.org.